I just watched the Canadians play 82 games this season. 82 miserable games. And they were bad, weren't they? They they were really, really bad. They finished near the bottom of the league. They probably could have fallen even more if it hadn't been for guys like Raphael Harvey Bedard and Mike Matheson going super saiyan towards the end of the season. They definitely robbed a couple of points. But anyway, having the fifth overall pick tonight wasn't too bad, you know what I mean? I even had this little wish list. I really wanted Will Smith if he fell to fifth. I even had some merch already planned that I was gonna sell. <laughs> some fresh Prince of Santra Bell t-shirts. It was gonna be awesome. But of course, Mike Greer of the San Jose Sharks, that dirty butthole, he really put a wrench into these plans, didn't he? But that was okay, because there was still a couple of really good names available. I mean, Medve Michkov, this guy is a wizard, okay? In my opinion, he's one of the most talented forwards at the draft. I thought he would fit into Montreal's lineup like a glove and be the superstar forward that the Habs haven't had in, what, decades? But no, Kent Hughes decided to take David Reinbacker at number five and he even sent Carey Price to the microphone to deliver the bad news. He was the bringer of bad news. And my God, he was confused. Even Price himself couldn't believe the shit that was about to come out of his mouth. <laughs> But Reinbacker was the pick, and I already feel kind of bad for him. I mean, it kind of sucks that he's the new guy in town and I'm already, like, making a negative video about this pick. But honestly, I think he's going to be a really good defenseman. I want to get that out there. That's really important. He is. He's going to be a good defenseman, but I just don't feel like he was the best player available at number five. That's my biggest issue right now. Obviously, Hughes and Gordon, these guys feel differently, and yes, they know more than me, but again, I didn't like this pick. What a waste of an opportunity to pick a talented forward at number five. Jeez. This, this turned out to be a worst case scenario for me. The Habs dressed five rookie defensemen this season. They had Jack Eye, Gooley, Harris, Honda Civic, and Baron. They got Mayu, Hudson, Trudeau and friends just chomping at the bit, trying to crack the lineup, and they're all kids. And I've already seen the argument, you know, that the right side of the defense list is not as stacked as the left side, and yes, I agree, but I still got two big problems with this, okay? Problem number one, I feel like the Canadians need for forward depth right now outweighs the need for depth on defense, and that's just my opinion. And problem number two, I personally don't think that David Reinbacker was the best player available at number five overall. So again, this is just how I'm feeling right now. I'm still confident that Reinbacker can be a stud defenseman, but at the same time, I'm disappointed that they didn't take Meechkov. Or even Leonard, man. Somebody with some good offensive talent. It's it's kind of weird because last year I felt a lot better after the draft. They got Doc, then they picked Uri Slavkovsky first overall. I mean, I know he's not a franchise player or anything like that, but still, man, it, it was exciting and I felt like they were on the right track. And now, if we fast forward to this year, <laughs> it's a complete 180 for me. Oh my god, so... Ryan Becker, I guess the ball's in your court now, man. I hope you make me eat my words. I really do. I hope you become like the next Bobby Orr or something. Go ahead and prove me wrong. But I don't feel like the best player available was taken at fifth overall. But anyway, let me know down in the comment section how you're feeling right now. I want to hear all about it. Don't forget to drop kick the like button on the way out of here. And hey... Oh, see you next time.